We are back to daybreak this morning. So many of us know that feeling where you go to the store with a, a bag full of sticky, noisy cans, it gets your hands all dirty. Uh, there was a, a West Michigan doctor who created this machine here, hoping that you can avoid the, having those trips. Yeah, soon you'll be able to use this to make recycling deposits from home. John Dommel has a look at Nessie, this one of a kind machine making that possible. I don't want to return my cans back to the store and I thought there had to be a better way to do it. And so the idea for a machine that allows you to do it all from home has finally come around. What Nessie does is streamlines it and utilizes um, infrastructure that we already have in place, meaning curbside recycling. Nessie only works with plastic bottles and aluminum cans. You drop one in, it scans the SKU code to prevent fraud, and then easy money. You can only put 250 cans in a day through a Nessie, and we have other certain parameters that um, don't allow you to put, you know, 150 in, in 10 minutes. It'll be available for businesses this summer and could be in your home by fall. Nobody wants to buy a machine that's hundreds of dollars uh, for us, but as a lease, we essentially would lease it to a home or lease it to a business for a five, $5 a month uh, for that. And then each can or bottle that goes through, um, the consumer or the business uh, receives seven cents from that. In 2019, which is the last year we have data for returnables in Michigan, there was a 12% loss in them just being thrown away. And Nessie could be the course correction we need. I'm trying to tap into the circular economy in Michigan of keeping the raw materials in the state and processing through local rec recycling facilities. It makes them more viable, um, and it promotes growth in the state of Michigan, too. So this is a, a pioneering deal coming out of West Michigan. <laughs> I'd, like to, I'd like to believe so. <laughs> in Spring Lake, John Dommel, News 8.